number one, the access, if you would, and then number two, transparency. Let's let's cover. So how can technology improve or help to improve the patient experience primarily in the healthcare delivery setting? So you've got a patient, they're coming to a clinic or they're involved in a course of care being treated by a clinic. How can technology be used to improve the patient ex experience in that setting, if you would? I think the two big areas that technology can really help improve a patient experience are number one, the access, if you would, and then number two, transparency. Let's let's cover topic number one. So access. Technology gives clinicians and patients a more accessible uh, way to communicate or to have more frequent touch points throughout the care experience. So whether it be before a patient even comes into the clinic, they can be sent notifications, email reminders, asynchronous healthcare communications through some kind of secure messaging platform, and that can carry on through the course of care. So they get evaluated. Maybe they're going to come back in a few weeks. If you're like me, physical therapy, occupational therapy, maybe they're coming back in a couple days. But in the interim, there's an open channel of communication that can take place between the clinician and the, the patient. Maybe the patient has a question about something. Maybe the the clinician remembers something or sees something in their off time. This happens to me every now and then. I'm still in the clinic you know, one day a week or so, but I'll be doing something on the computer or something you know, after work or something like that, and I think, oh, patient so-and-so would really benefit from XYZ. If I had an app or something like that, it's super nice to be able to open it up, pull it up, shoot a message to the patient, say, hey, so-and-so, I was thinking about you the other day and I just came across XYZ, whatever this tool is or whatever this um, technique is for pain reduction in my case. Why don't you try it and let me know how it works for your next appointment? Whatever it is, boom, it's done, it's there, and it's easily integrated and it's accessible to me and the patient and vice versa. If the patient has a question about something, they can shoot us a secure message. So that's wonderful. So um, number one, that accessibility piece, it just allows for more touch points and an improved continuity of care throughout the course of care with a, a between the clinician and a patient. The other area is the potential area to make great improvements in the patient experience is really in the area of transparency. Now, you could take this as far as you want to go, but Something as simple as data visualization for maybe the patient and their progress. So again, I come from the, the physical therapy space. It would be super nice if there was a tool or a, a platform even, maybe if it was integrated in our current patient engagement platform for the patient to be able to log in to see either a message that they sent us or that we sent them. And then to be able to see a dashboard of their progress towards maybe it's a goal, maybe it's a range of motion, a strength, or you know being able to walk 100 feet, whatever it is, and being able to track their progress towards that self-stated goal would be awesome. Um, and that would open up a huge level of transparency that just isn't there currently in the in the healthcare setting. I mean, a lot of times clinicians are seeing multiple patients in a day. They don't have necessarily the time to sit down and be like, okay, this is where you were. This is where you are. You can see where, where this is going. It gets documented sometimes in the EMR, but not necessarily put in a way or in a format that the patient can see it and understand. And one, notice that they're making improvements, but two, to see the value in the services they're providing. If they don't see that they're improving, maybe they don't plan on coming to the next appointment, right? So that's one area of transparency. The other area of transparency might be um, the cost of care, right? No one knows what healthcare is going to cost. So it'd be really nice to have some sort of patient platform, if you would. Maybe it's through the through their patient engagement platform where they can track their visits and their costs and their copay and their coinsurance and what their estimated cost is going to be. You should already handle that as much as you can on the front end, but sometimes patients forget and it would be nice to have them, to give them some sort of documentation so they can see within reason what the cost of care is totaling to so that they can make an informed decision about continuing care or seeking other options or, or whatever the case is. So those are two main ways that I see technology really helping to improve the patient experience in the healthcare, really the delivery mechanism of healthcare going forward.